Hi everyone, myself Alavat Ramesh. Specially, today we will talk the, about the T.S. Janko chemist recruitment in 2023, especially in Telangana state. So, Telangana state power corporation, power generation corporation limited, they released the recently the notification for the recruitment of T.S. Janko chemist. So, in this lecture, we will discuss about the important topics and uh, syllabus of the chemistry especially for T.S. Genco recruitment we will discuss slide by slide you can see here the first slide you can see actually when you join into that uh, uh, chemist in thermal power plant what is the role we need to do in the thermal power plant most of the people if they don't know what this is the big question to everyone what is the has a chemist people how they will work at thermal power plant what is the role what is the daily activities what are the work positions we need to do in the thermal power plant you can see the first question i make it like that what is the role of chemistry people on thermal power plant see the as a chemist people once you will recruitment in the chemist people they need to do these works like a water treatment we need to do water treatment water raw water treatment or softening for the cooling water treatment and demineralization using ion exchange and ro water processing and second one is the coal sampling checking you can you need to check as a chemistry people you need to check the coal sampling checking and front ends oil property checking and steam purity checking and boiler circulating water pump purity checking these are the as a chemist people then they know the what is the roles when once your recruitment has a chemist in thermal power plant and especially i need to inform to who are preparing for the ts genco they need to know the notification that related to other jobs with the same syllabus and the same portion so especially if you miss in ts genco they are ready to write the another one exam that is that NTPC National Thermal Power Plant Corporation Limited the assistant chemistry trainee this new equation is coming soon so be ready for these who are preparing for the TS Genco as a chemist people and you can see the RFCL Ramakundam Fertilizer and Chemical Limited they are also started to recruitment as a chemist people in chemistry lab and the production department so now you can see what is the has a chemist people the role in the thermal power plant and the what are the related to other jobs who are preparing for the chemist for the NTPC uh, like T.S. Genco they are also apply for the NTPC chemistry and the Ramakundam fertilizer corporations. Now you can see the next slide actually in Telangana state what are the various water plants thermal power plants mainly the water thermal power plants mainly the in telangana state there are the three categories one is the thermal power plant means the using of coal and they produce the electricity and second one is the hydrogel means the water will fall them the turbine will rotate that is the second source and third one is the solar panel so this is the three main source to generate the current so for that purpose they are started to recruitment of the as a chemist people they will work under the three categories one thermal power plant another is a hydrogel and another, third one is the solar panel now you can see the next one slide the government of telangana telangana state power generation corporation limited ts genco the direct recruitment for the post of chemist they can see here the TS Genco website further the more information and update you can see here www.tsgenco.com.in or either you can go here the http and tsgenco.ecgg.go.in the date of examination is 17 means the December month of 2023 the 17th is the exam date that is the very important now you can see here next what are the important dates for the applying and what is the date for the payment and the submission and date of examination you can see here the telangana state power corporation generation limited now you can see here 
is the Janko the chemist post you can see here and the last year also the this uh, recruitment is happen and you can see here the what is the contact information and you can hear the what is the eligibility criteria you can see here clearly the MS chemistry people and uh, along with the BSc chemistry people that are eligible for the this chemist post in first class marks and you can see the here then especially in Telangana state there is the two zones zone 1 and zone 2 especially zone 1 what are the thermal power plant and zone 2 comes under the what are the generating stations power generation stations now you can see here the what is the exam pattern so exam pattern the screening test is the paper so paper 1 there is they have two sections section 1 and section 2 section A is the 80 marks objective type questions and section Section B is the objective types that 20 marks. So section A is the subject oriented and section B is the 20 marks for the general awareness and uh, mental ability and numerical problems. Now especially you can see now section A objective types the syllabus for the chemistry people you can see the what are the syllabus you can see the coordination chemistry organometallic chemistry bio inorganic chemistry thermal methods and atomic force spec atomic absorption spectroscopy inductively coupled plasma and uh, atomic emission spectroscopy quantum chemistry thermodynamics chemical kinetics electrochemistry surface chemistry and spectroscopy chemistry these are the syllabus and you can see here the <coughs> next topic is stereochemistry reaction mechanism carbohydrates aromaticity interaction to the analytical chemistry gravimetric analysis and titrometric analysis water technology fuel technology and environmental awareness and the analysis of air and water pollution and water plant engineering and water treatment chemistry these are the main topics for the specially in the chemistry for recruitment portion and you can now you can move on to the section b the objective type question this is a general awareness like two units you can divide it into verbal ability and numerical ability their spotting of the grammatical errors and improve the sentence jumbling of sentence and reading comprehensions vocabulary number system arithmetic and data interpretation you can see the unit 2 is the general awareness like uh, uh, knowledge of program you can see here the current affairs related to telangana state indian economy and political sports and awards and important dates etc and organizations associated with business now i was seeing the many other uh, ntpc and other uh, competitive exams in the last two years also in the in tamil nadu state they announced is the the Genco recruitment then i saw the few of the important chemistry topics you can see the special in chemical thermodynamics physical chemistry organic chemistry inorganic chemistry in physical chemistry these are the main important topics you can see the thermal um, chemical thermodynamic atomic structures and states of matter and phase equilibrium and solution electrochemistry chemical kinetics surface chemistry and the nuclear chemistry now you can see the organic chemistry especially the basic stone of organic chemistry stereochemistry qualitative and quantitative analysis of purification of organic compounds preparation and properties and the reaction of alkenes alkynes and alkynes organic compounds is the functional groups containing with halogen organic compound functional group is containing oxygen and organic compounds containing the functional group with nitrogen reaction alpha beta unsaturated carbonyl acids and uh, the polymers spectroscopy measurement ir spectroscopy uv spectroscopy nmr spectroscopy and biomolecules like carbohydrate proteins vitamins nucleic acid lipids hormones especially that i was underlying this one environmental chemistry the bits is compulsory damn sure questions will come from environmental chemistry and chemicals in everyday life then you can move on to that inorganic important topics molecular mole concept and stoichiometry periodic table chemical bonding main group elements s and p block elements transition elements and lanthanides coordination compound electrical chemistry and bio inorganic chemistry these are the previous years the important topics especially in ntpc and the other competitive exams like uh, chemist recruitments in other sources of organization they are important topics i was uh, taken from the online now you can move on to the some important beans what are the repeated in the various competitive exams and the last the TS Genco and uh, and the NTPC and the Tamil Nadu state TS Gen Tamil Nadu state Genco recruitment bits are you can see here you can see which of the following is not for the common method for disinfection of water so here is mentioned the four choice out of the four you can choose one right one is the correct answer so by by boiling 
of water is the right answer for here the first one question the second one question is the the theoretical time taken by the particles of water to pass between the entry and exit of the settling tank when you can see the right answer is the detection period detection period is the right answer for the second one question now third one bit is very important and every competitive exam they are repeated this bit which I among these of the alternative BOD test for the determine the oxygen consuming potential of the waste water sample they are a THOD, COD, BOD, TOC so the right answer is the COD chemical oxygen demand is the alternate test for the BOD to testing of the oxygen consuming potential of the waste samples now you can move on to the fourth one bit you can see what does the SWOT stands for so SWOT stands for the the right answer here is given the four choice you can see the C1 is the right answer super critical water oxidation treatment is the right answer now you can see the fifth one what is stoichiometry the quantitative relationship between the reactant and product that is called nothing but the stoichiochemistry now you can move on to the sixth one bit this bit is very important lithium tetramethyl has the structure of square panel linear trigonal bipyramidal a tetrahedral so right answer is the tetrahedral i was given is the picture the how the these molecules how the arrangement lithium tetramethyl so fullerene or dash you can see here poly of fluorine macromolecule cyclic compound so c1 is the right answer for the family of polyhedral carbon allotropes nothing but of fullerenes now move on to the eighth one bit you can see who discovered the artificial radioactivity from the following so here is given the four options who are the first discovered the artificial radioactivity by the Irene Curies and Joilet so right answer is that D is the right answer next one see what COD measures dash so COD measure the C is the right answer the amount of oxygen so you can see here C is the right answer you can see here the amount of oxygen required for the oxidation of substance and the then the pollutant present in the water that is the uh, that is you can see here the measurement of COD now you can move on to the next one which of the following is the bio accumulate in food chain has a pollutant you can see here is the right answer so here it is the fluorinated pesticides the chlorinated pesticide is the right answer especially for the 10th bit now you can move on to the 11th one bit the pharmaceutical and pesticides industries which chromatography techniques are more useful here is mentioned here the glc and the tlc and the hplc and the gc mean especially the pharmaceutical and uh, pesticide industry they are using only the for the especially in the hplc HPLC is the right answer. High performance liquid chromatography is the right answer for the 11th one bit. Now we can move on to the 12th bit. What is the IQP, IUP name, name of the compound shown here? The International Linear Pure and Applied Chemistry. There is a one name in culture. So this structure you can see here the chlorine and the bromine then benzene the structure those so are d1 is the right answer you can see here the three bromo one chlorocyclohexane one in so this is the right answer for the 12th one now you can move on to the 13th one bit in hydrogen bond you can see here the hydrogen bond is based on the principle of what so here the nuclear fusion nuclear fusion and uh, natural radioactivity artificial radioactive so the right answer is the b nuclear fusion is the right answer now we'll move on to the 15 14th bit you can see electrolytes discovered by the associated with the because of this the force of electrostatic attraction broken down into the water now you can see the 15th where pure water does not conduct the electricity because of almost totally ionized 16th bit artificial fruits referring by the fruit green fruits be they are using ethylene and what is the chemical name of baking soda the right answer is sodium bicarbonate this is the really if you like this video please like share and comment subscribe to my youtube channel thanks for your great patience for your attention the next video i was making the 
the important beats and repeated beats the section 1 and section b we will discuss in the next youtube class thank for your kind attention